Hi everyone, I am Tirthar and I am presenting this spotlight talk on behalf of my co-authors from Robotics Group at SIDO, Australia. In this paper, we present a novel approach to motion planning for field robotics using probabilistic motion primitives. The motivation of our work comes from the fact that in spite of significantly different navigational challenges faced by a field robot, the planning strategy often remains the same. We present a framework where the motion primitives can themselves be adapted at runtime to perform locally suitable optimal planning. Motion primitive based planners like lattice planners are fast and generate kinematically consistent paths. However, they suffer from discretization overheads. On the other hand, trajectory optimization approaches can find optimal paths given enough time, but require high sampling rates in cluttered environments, often making them infeasible for real-time hardware runs. To address the challenges faced by these approaches, we propose utilization of a probabilistic representation of the motion primitives for field robots. This was first introduced in the learning from demonstration community as probabilistic movement primitives. Instead of having a discrete motion primitive, we define probabilistic motion primitive as a distribution of trajectories here encoded by a Gaussian distribution that acts as a motion primitive. primitive. Very spe specifically, we use a weighted Gaussian radial basis function to represent the distribution. Each weight sample encodes a single trajectory sample for a given basis function set. The weight distribution generates a trajectory distribution, which then represents a single probabilistic motion primitive. The advantage of using such a representation is that we can sample motion primitive trajectories from the distribution rather than being restricted to a priori fixed primitives and we are able to condition it based on the local information available, like goal points, obstacles, and other constraints at runtime. This makes it feasible to utilize locally adaptive motion primitives, improving the performance as well as success rate of trajectory optimization. We present two algorithms, prompt S, which uses a naive rejection sampling on the condition distribution, and prompt O, which performs stochastic optimization using important sampling on the conditional distribution. The progression of the planning steps is shown from left to right in a cyclical fashion. The motion primitive distribution is first conditioned on the goal or a wire point position. The trajectories are then sampled from this conditional distribution to perform feasibility evaluation. Infeasible samples are discarded and the underlying distribution updated to best represent the feasible trajectories. This step is performed iteratively until the mean of the distribution is a feasible trajectory. Choosing the mean over the first successful sample trajectory to execute shows better robustness during execution. More details of the approach with detailed discussions on sampling strategies are given in the paper. We performed a large set of quantitative tests on a randomized obstacle field with varying obstacle sizes for planners. The results show that Prompto outperforms prompt tests consistently due to better sampling strategy. Both of them outperform state-of-the-art optimization trajectory planners like Stomp and Tem. Prompto matches the performance of the state-of-the-art lattice planners like Falco, both in terms of success rates as well as in computational time for lower obstacle densities. However, as the obstacle density increases, Prompto outperforms such planners. This shows that Prompto is a robust planner both in terms of success rates but also close to real-time performance. A key advantage of prompt is its ability to allow for adaptation of the underlying motion primitive distribution. As shown in top left with scenarios like the damage to the wheel of a lunar rover, the robot's kinematics gets affected. A simple recalibration of the motion primitives, either from a higher module or learned in situ, allows such damaged robots to navigate obstacle fields. In a previous work, we showed how we can extract the weight distribution constituting the probabilistic motion primitives for a variety of field environments. Such learned motion primitives can be seamlessly incorporated into the prompt planning pipeline. We implemented Prompto on an autonomous AGV and ran numerous experiments on a variety of environments at Sardos Pulangal site. The results show robust performance of the planner in real-time hardware runs. Thank you for your attention and please refer to the paper or contact us for more details or comments and feedback.